Hey everyone, so remember when last week I was bitching about this ugly mani that I did that I hated enough that I redid it and did it this way instead? Yeah, well, I listened to the people because I love you all and I made this tutorial anyways because you all said you wanted to see it. So even though I consider this fishtail colorblind test looking really confusing like drunk dodicure on my nails to be kind of like a fail just because like it doesn't really look that good I'm making a video anyways just for you guys just so you can get a laugh out of how dumb it looks as always I start with a white base coat I use color club French tip from live love polish and you can get it at the link below I add a quick dry top coat because we're gonna add some tape next let it dry for 15 minutes and then I just use some rolls of striping tape. I think I have like 1800 of these rolls. And you can pick them up from Twinkled Tea. And you can use my code SIMPLY for 10% off. But you can also find them on eBay, Amazon, and the black market probably. I don't know. If you've worked with these striping tape rolls, you know that they are a bitch to work with. So I just cut off little pieces before I begin. And I stick them on the top of a nail polish cap. I'm starting to make the fishtail design outline basically. So I'm just adding them kind of like in a staggered fashion. It kind of looks like a braid. Some people call this a herringbone. I think it just looks like silver and hollow. So I'm not really thinking about what to call this right now because look at them. Look at them dance. Look at my fingers dance with hollow stripes. They're like spiders. Sparkly spiders. So I realized though that having these long sparkly hollow spiders on your fingers can actually like stick into the polish on the nail beside it. So I just trimmed them down so that that doesn't happen. I used dotting tools that I got from Live Love Polish in a model's own nail art kit that has a whole bunch of other stuff, but let's just talk about the dotting tools. So they have a round metal ball head and there's two sides to eat. So there's actually four different sizes of balls for all your different ball size needs. I just dip it on the polish brush and start dabbing away and refill when you need to. So I started with this color green because I thought it was like a nice emerald green. And then I'm going next with the purple for the look I thought I was going for. It doesn't matter if you hit the striping tape, in fact it's probably better if you overlap the striping tape because the goal of this Dottacure fishtail idea, idea, I say idea, okay was to cover all the white space showing except for the fishtail part. So keep dotting away with your next color. This is some color club, I forget what it's called, but it's pretty. I'm adding a punch of orange because I thought that would look cool. And I think at this point I was using the smaller ball on one of the dotting tools just to give it some variation. Keep filling in those white spaces. And then there was just a few spaces left of white um, that I thought needed some other colors other than the orange. So I just kind of switched around between the colors and made sure all the white spaces were covered. Grab some tweezers and peel off the striping tape one by one, starting with the ones that you laid down last. And now you'd think that the polish would be like super dry by now, cause like it looks dry if you actually look at it. And that the striping tape would like peel off all weird and get messy, but that didn't happen for some like voodoo reason. I don't know. I guess I was having a good day on the peel off tape part of the mini, but obviously a bad day on the idea execution part. So at this point my mind was just confused from staring at all these dots. So I just covered in a glossy top coat and thought, well, that was fun. Look, if I move my hand around really fast, it's like a super eye test for old people. And that's that. If you think this mani looks fabulous, then you should probably get your eyes checked. Thanks for watching.